that I don't know if you can see, but it's stitched here and here. And then all of this is, is painted. This is one of the works of art that Robin Hill is about to ship out to total strangers. Sure, this one says, unravel the circumstances. And this one says, the idea of casting. Sac State art curator Kelly Lindner came up with the idea called Hello Stranger. I really wanted um, this project to take on that, that sort of form that we can feel we still do have connections to other people. She asked artists to make small pieces of art that they could mail while asking the public to sign up for free art. So all of the artists that I have invited are super excited, um, primarily because they too are confined <laughs> to, you know, very limited spaces. Some of them don't even have access to their studios at the moment. Um, so this was a way for me to say, okay, what can you do from your home or for if you're able to get to your studio spaces, what materials might you have on hand? We're all confused right now. And so to have a project where um, it's sort of like being a student, someone's giving you an assignment and saying, um, work small, work with what you have. The artists have been working on this for a month and the first pieces will be mailed out this week. I think it was probably a wonderful time to just be on the receiving end of something that they didn't have to fight for or make a choice, this or that. You know, everybody's stretched really thin and something that doesn't have like a practical purpose, something to make their world more beautiful. Those who receive art are asked to write about it on a postcard like this. They'll be displayed at the Sac State Library Gallery along with creations from each artist. And eventually, when people can gather in person again, it will all send a message. How we can still use art as a way to connect to one another. And I also hope it will be sort of a reminder that we all are still connected. <laughs> in Sacramento, Edie Lambert, KCRA 3 News.